and uh, so SWIA gave me the opportunity to travel and to meet with weavers, indigenous weavers from all over Central America. And the collaboration and the networking and the connecting was very educational and I was, you know, I felt very honored that, you know, I had this, you know, wonderful opportunity to share my weaving knowledge and my stories. So that's, you know, what uh, the fellowship did for me and spoke to me and so I, I finished the program in fine woodworking and right about that time when I finished the program I applied to SWIA uh, for the fellowship and I got it the first year I applied. So I knew I was on, on the right track, you know, the right road. We had to take the engine and the transmission out and then we painted up like an Indian race car. And uh, on the on the hood on the windshield, we had uh, a back projection screen, so you could have an you could sit in this car and have an adventure going through a reservation. So that was like well, uh, some were just fun. Some of them just help us move in a different direction mentally of uh, what's possible in Indian art. And what do you do? You know, <clears throat> and he just told me bluntly. Just, you know, everything you want to say, brag about yourself, that's that. You know, we're on the phone. Right? So that's what you say, you know, just, just brag about yourself. <laughs> okay, you know, so I started writing this fellow, you know, writing my letter. It was like two and a half pages long. <laughs>